वेलकम बैक फ्रेंड्स सो फ्रेंड इन प्रीवियस वीडियो वी हैव ब्रॉड दिस मैप हेयर ऑन दिस प्लेस बट इट इज नॉट रिस्पॉन्सिव येट सो आई गो बैक टू माई नोट पैड प्लस प्लस कोड रीडर एंड आई सी फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई वुड लाइक टू टेल यू दस दिस डिव मिस्टेकनली आई डिड नॉट क्लोज इट सो यू सी दैट इट इज नॉट क्लोज एनी वेयर सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई एम टू क्लोज दिस डिव so i come down and here right after above the footer where the footer begins i close that div control s to save so now i come back here and refresh it so friend now this you you are watching the this, this strip is showing here so we are also to remove this strip so i go back to my notepad plus plus code editor and go in the in inside styled or css so in spite of 630 i also make it 600 control s to save so once again i come back to my chrome browser and refresh it so friend you see that strip also has been removed which was showing before under this map so friend now once again i go back to my notepad plus plus so friend now i will go to my queries dot css file and i will begin to do work over it so i come here on maximum width 1020 pixel at media only screen and maximum width i come here and i scroll it down little under this section and here after this curly bracket first of all i make comment maps so i press enter and here i write the queries for making the map responsive dot map i define it is with Hundred percent. Height three hundred pixel. Position relative. Z slash index column zero semicolon to close. So friends, I gave the height is height six six hundred in my style dot CSS page, but here I have given it is height three hundred pixel half. I have made it half. So I press enter. Go out of that class and call the next class here. Dot form slash box and curly brackets. With column one hundred percent position. relative semicolon to close height auto
padding 30 pixel padding left 10 pixel so friend I have written all this query so I will copy all this query copy and I will paste it in down query also the query which is for the query which is 480 pixel to 767 pixel so I come down and I paste it here control s to save so friend now I come back to my chrome browser and refresh this page I decrease it is size I come down so friend now you are watching that the map is showing even I have decreased it is size first it was not showing and form has come down under this map when I decrease the browser size So friend you see that this map has become enough responsive so now I once again increase its size and now friend I will once again go to this website and I go back and now I will go to this markers markers icon I will click over it and once again I will copy this code copy and now I go to my script.js file and here I will paste it control s to save so friend now I am to do some amendments in this code but first I would like to tell you that what is it is benefit so I come back here and show you that you are watching these markers so due to placing this code these markers will be will also be shown on our website page map so I come back here and begin to work over here So first of all friend I remove I remove it the down to text and I go to my browser and now I will copy this this code copy and I will paste it here so I remove this curly brackets but because we need only one so friend I also remove this text and here I write fast food also give title fast food F should be capital and here to control as to save now I change it also to 37 point
सेवन फाइव सेवन सेवन हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी टू फोर थ्री सेवन सिक्स सो नाउ आई गो टू माय फ्रॉम ब्रोजर go to my own page and refresh it so friend you see that this marker is also showing here and now i decrease it is size to see so friend i resume it is size so you see that now this map has become fully responsive so friend this map is also showing for fully smaller screen so friend now increase it is size and when i bring my cursor over this so you see fast food you are watching the title and when i click over it this fast food icon is showing her fast food because this this marker sign is show, um, sign is showing that our fast food restaurant is situated at this place so when the user will bring his cursor over it first he will show the fast food title and if he clicks over it he will say he will see that our fast food restaurant is situated at this place so friend this was the last video of this course so in this course we have made this complete fully advanced full with restaurant theme so friend now i think after learning this video and previous videos you will be able to make any kind of html 4.0 5.0 and css3 website layout to a professional level so friends now give us permission to leave and keep us keep us remember in your prayers